Northern Fire was started by two friends that saw a demand for quality cannabis in Michigan. Our ambition when designing this facility was to give the plants an environment where they can thrive to their potential. Prioritizing the proper heating and cooling system along with Volt Server was really a great foundation for providing the plants the proper environment they need to maximize their photosynthetic process. Our cultivation goal is to grow beautiful cannabis through flow and not force, meeting each cultivar with the environment, lighting, and soil conditions needed to reflect its genomes unrestricted. Um, Bill Garrett, Cunningham Electric, owner, operator, been working in Kalkaska for 38 years, family owned business 50 years this year. This is my first install with Volt Server. You know, I'm trying to think of anything that I don't like about the system. I haven't found anything yet. We're here at Northern Fire Cannabis. First electrical room. This is our main distribution panel. 400 amps, 480 volt. Step down transformer, 12208, three phase panel. We've got our volt server rack, very nice system. So these are transmitters. You get a signal from your computer that tells your transmitter to power up the lights. It's ramped up to whatever level, whether you're 50%, 80%, 100%. 100%. The 12 hour cycle goes in, it ramps back down. The relays switch over to room number two. So you're still using the same transmitter, but it's feeding the second room. So we have a 60 amp, 480 volt circuit that feeds both rooms. In the typical install with a 480 volt system, we'd have over 150 amps feeding both rooms. These are digital cables output from our relays. It goes out the top of the rack, comes up through the ceiling, through the ceiling to a cable tray. Our belt and eight pair cables come across to undo a J-hook. Each cable that comes in picks up eight lights off of a rack. They're quick connect. You can plug them in, out, whether in operation or not. So if you need to replace, it's quick and easy to do. It took us about four hours to pull all the cables for the the two rooms, pulling the cables, getting all the lights assembled, terminating them, you could do it in a day. Not a problem at all. I think it took more time to take everything out of boxes than it did to install it. It really did. Light output is tremendous and very impressive and the ability to control light levels up, down. You're not stuck with one level. Minimal heat compared to the high pressure sodium rooms. High pressure sodium rooms that we've run, within turning the lights on five minutes, the room temperature has changed 10 to 15 degrees. Bang that quick. It's, it's comfortable in here right now without any AC going. Very much with your high pressure sodium, you're running at 480 or 277. The, the potential of shock hazard is, is always there. With the digital, very minimal. You're not gonna risk any of your employees. From an electrician standpoint, install this product, it, I would 100% recommend it. It's safe, it's easy to install, simple, self-diagnostic, user-friendly. I've been an electrician for 38 years. Quality-wise, I haven't seen anything this good.